So after tearing my hair out last night coding this and reversing the Steam modules, I have literally found every trace that Valve uses to store your hardware ID for Trust Factor. Over the past 14 hours, I've been coding a complete way to keep yourself unique to the system every Moonlight launch. You don't need to run the Steam Batch file people pass around. I don't even think that works. People just say it does, and then they end up in Red Trust Factor again on these new accounts because their hardware is flagged. It does the normal hardware ID change that Valve is known to store. Then you'll notice it will tell you it changed your MAC address for you. But then you'll notice your internet disconnects. So what's happening here is that Moonlight is manipulating your devices safely because if you reverse some of the modules, Valve is looking at your network devices. But if you tried to change the information it's looking for and tried to reset your network device so the new information gets implemented, your internet won't work until you restart because Windows is going to tell you some routine was broken or something like that. I did find a way for that not to happen. So every time you run Moonlight at this point, you should have a completely new network identification. Everything Valve looks for will be completely different every launch. So I just wanted to show the members this and break this down because people are going to be too lazy to read all this if it's typed out. 